Hello, and welcome back, Josh and Sam, to Western Supermare, and possibly the best intro for a while. Now, uh, we've played a few games, apologies for the end of the last video, BT dubs. Uh, Mash came in, and then we were chatting, and then uh, I thought it'd be easier to just sort of um, get everything sorted uh, with what we were doing in the evening before... Uh, coming back to record, and then it's tomorrow now. So hey, anyway, what did we do last time? We lost three one to Man United. We followed that up. You would have been able to see it if you if Masha hadn't come back at the time that she did. Uh, with a three 0 win over Swansea, it was nice. So Tooney scored, uh, Cotney scored. We then took revenge on Man United, winning two nil. Uh, Willington Torres scored, and uh, Nasser Adin Haircat scored an own goal, a sensational own goal. Uh, the ball was crossed in low. One of the defenders kicked it right up Haircat's ass, and it went into the goal nets. Uh, then we beat Chelsea 2-0, we beat Villa 1-0, and then we bloody well drew with Leicester. Meaning that the Premier League looks a little like this. Six points behind, so not the end of the world. City beat Arsenal, by the way, so we're only three points behind Arsenal now. Six points behind City. Uh, yeah, so it's... I, I mean, obviously we're still in touching distance, it's not the end of the world, but it's uh, getting to be... These draws are starting to really piss me off. Anyway, now we've got a uh, cup double for you. Uh, United away in a crucial League Cup semi-final. And then uh, Sheffield Wednesday in the FA Cup, who we haven't played for three or four years now. So it's quite nice to have Sheffield Wednesday back in the pick. Uh, oh, is this the post? Oh, right, yeah. So we, we I think we equalised right at the end. And we had two or three goals. Yeah, we did. We, we equalised at the last kick of the game. And we had three goals ruled off for offside. I'm not going to get myself upset. Uh, yes, good, let's carry on. Uh, yes, I am. Uh, but we had, yeah, we had about three goals ruled off, and it was ridiculous. Very annoying. Um, this video is being recorded prior to uh, what I expect to be a very busy evening. Um, does he look good? They're saying he's going to be decent, but he's four and a half million already. How can that possibly be true? Uh, I don't want him. Anyway, yeah, also the club is claiming they don't have enough money to upgrade our, our, our um, facilities, but I will show you something cool in a second. Let me just go and see if I can ask him again for anything. No, that's what I want. <coughs> no, I can't. We've got a new feeder club, or we will do soon. Um, can I ask for... No. Okay, never mind. But yes, look. let's look at something very quickly. Information facilities. We've got good youth facilities. Which is very exciting because that means that sometimes our kids might actually end up being decent. Uh, I'm going to try and do the same with the training facilities. Uh, hopefully we can get them to a good standard as well. And then we might be able to start challenging these big boys on a longer term basis. Um, Johan has gone out on loan, has scored two goals in three games, which is super duper. And another couple of players have also gone out on loan, uh, but nothing particularly interesting. Oh, Mao went on loan. Someone offered to take him off us for some money. So I thought, well, why not? He's not played at all for me. Um, dismiss. Well, he's injured. Uh, how good is he? Oh, he's awesome. Yeah, this guy, so this guy's really, really good. Uh, but I can't buy him because he's worth too much money, basically. I need to sneeze. Uh, so excuse me for a minute whilst I sneeze. Here it comes. No? <laughs> Christ. Okay. Well, that was exciting. Um, we've got a player out on loan at uh, uh, Plymouth as well, so I'm doing my best to help out Flinny. Uh, <laughs> second attempt at the sneeze. We take a narrow 2 0 win. <laughs> uh, I'm confident as long as we stick to our game plan. I'm confident in the whole team. Um, it's not necessarily. Transfer window signs up. These things can happen quickly. And they can. I just don't think I'll be signing anybody. We have enough of a squad that people are already getting upset they don't get enough games. I've never been the best at uh, rotating properly. Like, I think Sam is clearly much better at it than I am. Um, yes, keep him, keep going, fellas. Um, oh, Jonathan Starbuck constantly having a cold. Speaking of, me as well, seems to be. And, uh, yeah, it looks like we're going to have Arsenal. We are. We're going to have Arsenal in the cup final if we get there. <laughs> Apologies for the sniffles, uh, the sneezing has done it, and the sneezing has only come on since I pressed record, as is pretty much standard for anything. Anyway, Ben Wheatman, manager of Western Supermare. <laughs> uh, dear, 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 Jan Skauskas, Lithuanian, oh, he's probably the best player Lithuania's ever had. Very nice. Right, now then, away at Old Trafford, we have to grind out a result, we probably need to score a goal. 
these are things. Uh, we're going to play with Mounier on the wing. We're going to play with Nakubri in the middle. We're also going to have Abdullah in the midfield there, and I'm going to put Elias on for Kotnik. Pedersen played like an absolute piece of crap in the last game, so he will not be continuing, but you will be taking Bayon's place. Uh, otherwise, the team is fairly full. Oh no, we're going to keep K uh, Khalil Al Salululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululululul
did we do we know who we've drawn in the Champions League yet? I think we drew Porto, did we, or or someone like that? Okay, I'll check after this. Sashevsky missed. I forgot that I can mute it. Okay, well that's a positive first half. Let's not ruin it right at the end. Torres out to Fitzgerald. Fitzgerald to Elias. Zatuni. Elias. McCubri. Abdullah. Torres. Do your thing. Elias. McCubri. Fitzgerald. Abdullah. Oh, Elias. Oh, what football. Oh, la, 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 la. La, 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 la. Yeah, come on, Weston. Lovely old stuff. That was a great finish from Elias as well. Lovely bit of football. Nice uh, recycling of the ball there by Abdullah and by Makubri. Hint of offside, I thought, maybe, but let's not talk about that. Uh, yeah, work is looking like it's going to be busy. Um, but if it's not, I will uh, endeavour to play some more and then get through a couple more games, maybe get to the Champions League game uh, so that we can have a little bit more progress on this season because after having complained that I've filmed too many videos, I haven't actually made much progress in the season uh, so far. Although we are now past Christmas already. Torres now, superb break here. <sighs> no need for that. It was, who was it? Zatuni arriving at the back post. You could have just waited a little bit more and then put it across there, but whatever. Restrepo, great save from De Gea. De Restrepo signed a new contract recently because he was being uh, tapped up by other clubs. And I also realised he was on a criminally low weight. He was on something like £10,000 a week, uh, despite being a, start that's offside, a starting Premier League uh, centre-back. So I upped it to, I think, 20000 It's still not very much, um, which is good for us. Um, Sam mentioned that I should sign the um, sensational Turkish player that I showed you from uh, from Bayern Munich. Um, in the summer if possible uh, I'm going to look into that because it does appeal to me he's still insane like it's he's 32 but he's still ridiculous uh, he's probably better well he's definitely better than Dania and he's a year a year older than him so we'll see how he oh good save from De Gea nice from Restrepo lovely play Montignelli um, yeah so we'll see how that goes the trouble is his wages are he's currently being paid £110,000 a week by Bayern and which we cannot match so it really does depend on um, what happens in the summer. If we find some young player instead, that will be what I prefer to do because I don't really like buying players that are 30. Because also I'd have to pay like 17 million for him probably and I don't want to do that. Um, I'd much prefer to get that midfielder that I just showed you from Valencia if we can get him or if we can get that Casado guy also from Valencia. Abdullah, great tackle there. Ooh, sensible play by... No, oh, Hodgson's been injured. We should have had a penalty, apparently, but who cares? I'll allow it. Abdullah getting a lecture. Why? What do you do? Anyway, here's our throw, which was put out for their injured player, so really we should have just <laughs> given it back to them, but whatever. Said Suarez. Kapan. Stashevsky. Suarez. Great save from Khalil. Just got to get used to calling him Khalil, and then we'll be happy. Bayon is going to come on for Engblom, who's not playing brilliantly. Um, Christiansen will come on for Torres. Christiansen has been playing very well recently when he's come, now that he's back from injury. Uh, he's just a good all-round player. He's not as strong. He's not technically as sort of good as the rest of them, but he just is a good player. He plays well. That's what I like. It's very much like Mads Pedersen in that regard. Although at the moment Mads Pedersen has not played well, which is a, a massive shame. Because I think he's only a couple of goals away from getting 200 league goals for the club, but he just never seems like scoring whenever he's on the pitch. <laughs> It's a Tooney great start. McCubrey. This is what's slightly frustrating for me, is that we're now playing so much better than them at their place. We just lost 3-1 here the other week. So I don't know why that that, that sort of inconsistency very much frustrates me. Um, I'm sure there's an answer for it. I'm sure Sam knows it. Great finish, but it was offside. <sighs> Haircat. Thompson, De Gea, her cat, her cat, his cat, McCubrey, Christiansen, great ball to Zatuni, Thompson's wiped him out, he's got to be sent off for that, and now Pedersen's going to get his chance to get a goal, Stevie T, off he goes, 
It's all falling apart for Man United here. Slavin Bilic saying he likes me a lot. Well, he's not going to like me after this. Pedersen. Oh, good effort. It's been a fairly comfortable victory for us, assuming we do get the win on the night. I mean, overall, I don't think we're going to concede three now to go to extra time, but McCubrey hits it, surely. No, he did, but rubbish. Bayon, great touch. Abdullah, McCubrey, Mounier, we're camped in their half. It's ridiculous. Mounier smacks it into the back of Zatuni's head, and the ball goes off for a goal kick. Look at all these tiny dots. Look at that. We're through to the final, where we will play Arsenal. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. We could retain the League Cup, which would be beautiful. Elias with the goal. Puts us through 3 0 on aggregate. Yeah. 12th time in history that they've lost an aggregate. Uh, the English could potentially be seen as a contender. But okay, so they're not even that. Their reputation has obviously gone down slightly. Um, so they should have had a penalty. We should have had a penalty. And we, we did score, so that's good. Khalil did well because he is excellent. I really like him. Junior does not want to go and play in Chesterfield anymore. <laughs> it's perfectly reasonable because um, <laughs> uh, they're not very good. But I expect that now when he comes back, he will be able to be snapped up by some other team. That's what happened with, uh, I think, uh, Zdravko Geng did the same thing. He came back and uh, Alan Torres is still playing. Yeah, it's decent. Uh, yeah, uh, Zdravko Geng came back from playing for, I think, was it Stevenage? And then went straight back out on loan to a team at the higher end of the table. Uh, he's also apparently a Sammy Pussinen. Come on now. Uh, he's also apparently going to be the next... Um, what's the... Luka Modric. Which is pretty cool. Although I don't think he... I don't know if that's actually true. Uh, but he, he's, he's good. Uh, <laughs> he's, he's, he's good. Um, Robert Pereira. Nope. Mladenovic. Mladenovic. So I'll check the. Uh, let's check that. Do we get a draw for the Champions League? Yes, we did, and it was Valencia. Okay. Oh yeah, I remember. I remember. Oh man, that that run. Look at that run. Valencia, Arsenal, Man City, Everton, Arsenal, Valencia. I mean, ooh. and then one of those is a cup final. That's insane. <laughs> um, Ramirez. Oh, look, Ramirez is the manager of uh, where Sheffield United. <laughs> well done, him. Um, cool. Let's go back. Uh, I don't care. Let's talk about him. He's the ninth. They're not doing that well, are they? Um, I'm aware that it's an issue. No, I don't think it'll be a problem. I said once that they share my confidence we are going to win this match and then we went on and lost like 4-0. Uh, I can't remember when that was. Uh, it was possibly one game that was off camera. It might have even been before we... Um, possibly even before we played on me doing recordings. But yeah, it was a, a big rake-up call for me. Don't do that because it put them in such an overconfident mood. <laughs> or rather the point was that it, they were so jacked up on belief and then they lost comfortably that that then destroyed their confidence. So... Yeah, and then we went on a very poor run. I think that was the season before we started recording. Okie dokie. Um, what are we looking at here? What? Oh, he's the Huddersfield man. Oh, yeah, of course. Okay. <laughs> what? Pochettino is the older shot. Oh, Man United. What a terrible week for them. <laughs> okay. Arsenal are already out of this cup, I think. I'm pretty sure in the last round. Third round. Did Arsenal not get knocked out by. Yeah, they got knocked out by Spurs. So. Now, who, who are the big who are the big hitters in this one? Still left in it. Chelsea, Man, United, Man City going to knock someone out. Uh, Bradford probably not going to knock out Spurs, but we'll see. Southend did it. This could be the day for the shocks, although let's not say that when we are playing a lower league team. Uh, we are at least playing them at home. Uh, Pedersen is going to take charge of this one. We're also going to give Jesus Orfila a game in the middle. 
and Gonzalez will play on the sidelines. Um, we've got to play Wolves soon, so we're going to do... No, what are you doing? I just did that. Okay, otherwise I think we look fine. Let's play with Figuera out on the left. Otherwise we're good. Uh, oh, they're playing that funny formation that I don't like. Come on, lads. I'm not... See, I hate... Uh, uh, I never say I expect you to win because it just always backfires. There's just such a massive chance that it's not going to work well. It doesn't end well. Everyone cries. I cry. You cry. Fitzgerald cries. Um, and it just seems like a pointless uh, exercise in futility because you know that if you say that, you're just tempting fate. The game is a game. It's not real life. You know. It's, oh, it's a decent effort from uh, Matchkiewicz. Uh, Pedersen now flicks the ball to back post. Elias heads it over. Can't get a goal in this competition yet. Two minutes in there. We've had two shots. That's not too bad. Two, 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 two. Mbemba. Are they playing Jack Rodwell still? Oh, for crying out loud. I think in every game we've played against a lower league opposition this season, we've conceded first. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. What's his name? Costas Cosmas. What a name. I don't mind. Who did he do that? Restrepo. Fucking useless. Mbemba. Jack. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> right. Okay. Well, when I said, uh, is this the day for shocks? Probably. Because what will happen now is Torquay will beat Liverpool. Bradford will beat Spurs. Uh, somehow both City and Chelsea will be knocked out of the cup. And it would have been a perfect procession to the title. And now we're bloody losing 2-0. Fitzgerald and Figuera. Elias. Ay, why you what? Orfila Mounier. Great ball. Torres must. Torres doesn't. Mounier. Figuera, get there. Come on, that's it. Mounier. We've got enough firepower on the pitch still. And we were playing the, the club's top goal scorer, the club's record goal scorer, <laughs> and one of the best strikers in world football today against Sheffield, United, uh, Sheffield Wednesday from the Championship, who are now going to be three? No. Good, good place to clear the ball to when no one is. Uh, Engblom, Pedersen wins the ball. Torres now moving forward. <sighs> Wasn't going in either, you could have just left it sooner. Torres, Mounier, offside? No, okay. Orfila, great ball back up to Elias. Matchkovic, no, Elias. Orfia, Orfila, that's another corner. 20 minutes in. Are we, I, I, I don't look here and see that they've only had two shots. They have! Both of them on side. Uh, both of them on target. Both of them goals. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, Englom, ay, fuck. <laughs> Patterson now. Figuera, Mounier. Figuera, Orfila. That's oh, good enough. Maskiewicz. Oh, he's at the crossbar from 40 yards. Ah! Oh, God. Oh, wait, picking it up, that was quick. Ay, 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 we're just blasting the ball all over him let's go and attack 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 we've got the ball we're we're in control in command it's the right time to put us to attacking mode Mounier Torres Orfila Orfila I mean I, I feel like he's doing well but I expect he's probably statistically the reason that we're losing because we didn't we're not playing anyone else in a weaker position really we're just playing he's the only youth player that started Mounier, it's gone in. Oh. <laughs> How's he done that? <laughs> oh, me, 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 me. Very unlucky from Suma. What did he do? Does it, will it tell us? Get the ball moving. He sort of must have, t I don't know, tripped over it, fallen over it, tapped it into his own net with his ass. Idiot. <laughs> Orfila, great ball out. Fitzgerald, Elias. Why is Elias facing you? Turn around and run the other way. 
Cross the ball in. Pedersen doesn't get there. Engblom, though. Orfila gets there as well. Mounier. <sighs> Fitzgerald to the back post. Mounier, no. Cosmas. Orfila out to Elias. Oh, yes. Oh, yo, yo. Torres. Nha! <laughs> Orfila. I mean, you'd have thought, I'd have thought, oh, I was so expecting that to be an equaliser. I'm going to have to have some tea. Oh, that's good. Mounier. Restrepo at the back post. Ah, yuck, 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 yuck. Torres. Oh, sorry, I was not looking. <laughs> Hashtag professional. That's like the equivalent of me doing the, um, when I used to do the uh, blog versions, not taking a screenshot of the team that we were playing. Uh, assertive, where's your passion, lads? Khalil is looking like he's going to... Who is playing poorly here? Pedersen constantly playing like an absolute drain. Both the centre-backs playing terribly. Uh, we'll give Pedersen and one of the centre-backs another 10 minutes. 55. Uh, Mounier. Restrepo heads the ball over again. We are absolutely dominating them. Okay. We're going to go with Christiansen on for Pedersen. We're going to go with Kotnik on for Elias. And we're going to go with Albert Bayon on for Restrepo. This will be where the three players that I took off just combined to score a goal. Pedersen will probably score now. Please take the corner before we do this substitution because I hate it when the game uses the, sub the corners as an opportunity to... Engblom! Ah! Stupid. Calamaris, Khalil. We don't want a replay. Right, lads, so if you're not going to score two, I'm not interested. Don't score one if you're not going to score a second, a third. Chris Jansen nearly gets there. Kotnik, Chris Jansen, Maskevich. Oh, yo, 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 yo. We're going overload. <laughs> We're dominating them enough that overload shouldn't damage us too much. By on the. By oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen such a sensational volley from a centre back? Straight at the damn keeper. Ah, tits. Yeah, but we can still take the corner, thank you. Right. Bayon, what are you doing? Majkovic up to Mounier. Ah, oh, I can't believe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop, stop fouling them, you doobles. You doobs. Okay, Figuera, Mounier to Torres. Torres just wide. I mean, are we looking at these stats again? 25 shots, 9 on target, 1 goal. Mounier, Figuera. Bayon, Figuera. Mounier. Okay. McCann. Engblom gets there. Kotnik, Matskiewicz. Uh uh. Suma. Orfila to Torres. Here we go. Nope, we don't because that's a ter Oh! Ooh. Mounier. Engblom! Yes! Come on! Right. That was a lot of tea I just drank. Of a good cause. He's been doing it all bloody game. Couldn't have done that earlier. Now we're going to have to do a replay, aren't we? At Hillsborough, which is just. <sighs> Great. Not happy with your performance out there. That was poor. I don't know why you're so upset. You did well. <laughs> just sickening, really, isn't it? 
Um, Mounier, two assists. Excellent player. Just an excellent player. Real Madrid won him, which uh, tells you everything. Yeah, so uh, Plymouth have Tvorno. Uh He's played two games, scored one goal, and uh, has an average rating of 8.4 because he's insane. Uh, Geng. <laughs> He's now on loan uh, with McDonald's, uh, which I detest, but I'm going to allow it. Uh, Johan is now with Crawley. Uh, Christopoulos is now with Watford, where he's doing very well. Uh, and, yeah, we... With, I mean, how the hell they didn't bloody... <sighs> that's, I mean, it's insane. Any other day we'd have won 9-0. Um, I'm not going to talk about the penalty. West Ham... Yeah... Okay, Willington Torres didn't have much luck. I'll just have to move on quickly. Clearly, Mans has immense quality. Stop talking about Mans Pedersen. He's lovely. Uh, yes, and Mounier was very good. He could have scored more. He could have scored five. Everyone could have scored five. Right, let's go to fixtures. I think what we will do... When's the replay? No, we're not going to bother with that. We will do uh, Champions League uh, knockout and then Arsenal in the Cup final as our next games. So, I will do these four, and then maybe I'll do another recording before I start work. See you later, guys. Bye.